guys how you doing just thought i'd pop out today take some photos as you can see i'm all camered up <laughs> um so i've just been watching some sparrows in here so i wanted to get some shots i'll be sure to share them with you just thought you might want to come out just come out just round back of all these houses here it's just a pathway that leads uh, away from my house down the back you always see plenty of wildlife in these hedges here so while I've got a couple of hours and the sun's out I'll come out for a quick walk bring you guys with me um, I'll show you my cameras in a bit I'll let you know what lenses and everything I'm using today just thought it might be interesting for you guys to come out so you will get to see the pictures that I take Hopefully I will come across some interesting standard English birds as I'm going down this pathway. As you can see I've got the ATD connected to my 120-400mm Sigma. Uh, I've had that for about five, six years now. Works brilliantly. I love it. Um, so the main reason I came to this part here is again not far from the road or the houses is uh, you get a lot of wildlife around here. You get a lot of birds going down to the river there just that you can see which is actually the overflow um, for the motorway which is about a mile behind me roughly so it's an overflow for that so this is where all the water gets stored. Um, can just turn around a bit I'll show you a bit as long as that sun's not in the way um, and it all gets comes down here sometimes this place is full right up with water and other times it's not just depends really but you do get a lot of wildlife around here obviously the ground's really damp you get lots of bugs lots of life and it's always a good place to stand so I've just walked in through the sty here and I've always wanted to photograph this tree um, it went down in the gales probably about three years ago so it's had a quite a bit of growth of moss and stuff so I'm just going to take some photos and just share them with you as well. Sometimes we get, I've seen deer in here and we definitely get the squirrels. One's just run off over there. Doubt if I'm gonna catch him now though. But with this photography like you never really know what's around the next corner. There's plenty of wildlife as you can hear. There's a blackbird just flowing off in front. These benches look interesting as well. I wonder if I can take a photo of that and make that actually look interesting. Let's give it a go. This is always an eerie looking place. Um, this is one of the overflow areas deep in the woods. Um, so if you look, it all looks like, you come down here at night and it looks like a great big spider. It's all a bit weird. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shoot a picture right between these trees and try and frame it up using those two trees there. Let's give it a go. I wonder what it's gonna look like. Hope you enjoyed that little trip thought i would just bring you out with me so we could take some photos together hopefully you enjoyed the photos all the way through this video if you did please leave a message below give me a thumbs up share the video it'd be great you have a great day thanks for tuning in thanks for watching me on youtube hey thanks very much for watching my video if you haven't subscribed to my channel just click on my face there and you'll subscribe to my channel so you won't miss anything also just click on one of these videos around me you might find something you like so thanks again you have a great day take care of yourself